Hey there, everybody. Fet here, and welcome back to Fet Plays RimWorld Ideologies. Uh, Ramos got messed up pretty badly by a Mega Sloth. Uh, we're probably not going to be messing with the Mega Sloths again anytime too soon. We got a bunch of people getting their age reversals, and you know what? We got enough of these for everybody. I don't know if you remember. I don't know if you even paid attention. We had a, uh... Hey, Ramos can walk again. We had uh, a community post. And by we, I mean I, because it's my channel. It's, I'm doing all the posting. That said, I had three goals before the end of RimWorld Ideology Season 1. Goal one was to do all the research. We're working on it. What, you know, we got a couple more to actually that we can do, and we got two more that we can't do yet, but we're so close to being able to get done. Number two was get at least one relic. We're on the way. We have two out of five pieces of info for the relic, for the ancient unknowable. We have a complex available that we can get a third one, and there's an available covert installation one. We send out five colonists for... No, well, we have four days to complete whatever that is. Yeah, th that, we should be able to do that too, maybe, in theory, kind of, possibly. Which would mean we need we would need one more. However, the third one was to make sure there's enough age reversals for everyone, and we have that. My dudes, we have enough age reversals for everybody. Apparently, Miskatonics is overdue. Um, but yeah, a everyone can live forever, basically. Hey, look at that big, beautiful solar generator, keeping us feeling good, keeping us feeling better. All right, a little bit more battery power going on. It's all good. I want to close this area up, of course, which is going to take some more granite, and that'll take time, and you know, that is what it is. Yo, our, uh... Oh, we're supposed to be spreading some knowledge, dudes. Yeah, we got, uh, we're, we're almost late. Let's get that done, and let's also clean up the shape in here. Um, who's nearby who can do that? Squid, can you clean this area up? Because, like, it got Mega Sloth blood all up in it. And that's ticking us off. Dirty ass room. Okay, that at least cleared up the disrespect. Hey, finish cleaning up this room, please. Uh, you know, make it... Actually, it's still somewhat impressive, even with all the Megasloth blood all over it. Alright. Get a little bit more cleaning up done. You don't have to completely... Yeah, yeah that's good enough. Uh, let's go ahead and spread some knowledge while we're here. Hey. Gather some wood and get some goodness happening. Watch out for that mad squirrel coming to the colony, though. Watch out, rat one. There they go. Also, there's a snowman over there. Knowledge is spreading. Mad rat is... Wait, what the hell? Is the cougar chasing the rat? I think the cougar is hunting the rat. Hold up. Our savior is here. It was. That was amazing. Oh, and he just ate the whole damn thing. All right. Anyway, knowledge has been spread. It was beautiful. Butthome saw it and was like, dang. That was neat. Good job, team. Uh, ten extra relation. Can't complain about that. We can, but we won't. I won't. All right, electricity going down. So, yeah, obviously the power is going to, you know, up and down, up and down. We don't have a big, good, consistent uh, form of power. I mean, we could tear this down or reconstruct this, do something with this, and build another geothermal right here. I mean, that is a good idea. We missing some uh, conduits over here or what? Yeah, we are. We're missing one right here. That's right. I put in that order to, to do that, and I forgot about it. I could swap Pepsi over to being a melee fighter now. If we did that, we'd need to get a shield belt. Which is fine. You know, we have room for shield belts. Yeah, you know what? Go ahead and get us a new shield belt. I think it's a good idea. Now, you only need a few melees and a few ranged fighters to really make things pop. Alright, this, this snowman looks like it was decapitated. Like, just straight up killed. With the blood. Right under it. Whose blood is this? The Sir Hop's blood. Oh my gosh. He literally put his blood, sweat, and tears into that thing. 
I don't know if Sir Hop's one who built that, but... If he was, it was extra funny, then. Plain leather is deteriorated away in storage. This is unroofed? Well, hot dingity dang, yes it is. Let's uh, fix that. <laughs> because we can. There, just go ahead and get the corners, too. Yeah, just roof up the whole dang surface area here. The, the square area. The square area. Okay, we have better healing things now. We can make a healing enhancer. Or a coagulumulator. So you can coagulumulate your blood. Yeah, it's a good idea. The healing enhancer in particular. You know, you heal faster. Coagulator, you bleed less. Both of these are good ideas. How many of them require advanced components? That's the question of the day. And the answer is probably both of them. Or all of them. Everything requires advanced components. Four. And 15 Plasteel. Plasteel's not that big of an ask. You know what? Make me... Two of them. Make me two of them. We'll pro try to do it without, you know, goofing it. Lord knows if we can, though. You know, I think... Everyone now should have been upgraded to at least bionic legs. It, if they have, like... They had a worse leg or a missing one. Doll could use an upgrade, too, though. Just saying. Squid actually has no bionic parts. Neither does Ramos. Hopefully these are all gonna heal up just fine. That's... Kind of a potential problem. How much longer you got? 1.2 days. We're gonna wait till they're out. Of course. Hey, how about we not let this cougar just hang around inside of our colony? Someone will hunt it. It'll be real quick. Royal Tribute Collector's coming. It'll be real quick. There you go. Squid's got this. It's running. It has chosen to run. It is missing a tail, so it'll bleed out. Squid does not care that it will bleed out. Squid wants it dead now. <laughs> Shield belts are done. Now it's fast. Where'd it go? I have no idea where we decided to put this shield belt. Over here. It's excellent. Hey, hey, hey. How does that compare to... Okay, you Shahab has a masterwork one. Camaro? I don't know yet. Pepsi? I don't know yet. We'll find out in 1.1 days. And we'll just dare to compare, you know? It'll be good. I don't want to give you anything. I, I just don't care. <laughs> if I have good relations with the Empire. But yeah, now this is all roofed up. This stuff won't deteriorate anymore. That's good. I mean, it was bad that they were. That was... You know, mistakes. I make them. Occasionally. From time to time. In this game that we call Rim World. I want to put down more flooring, but, you know, I can't until we get more granite. And we just, we don't want to get more granite. We just don't do it. Right, and nobody has time to haul rocks. Spring has sprung. Hey, it's the first of April, May. 5506. Sweet. And we're about to get out of the pod? Sweeter. This is actually phenomenal. Yeah, this is actually 10 out of 10. Because it means we'll get to go soon. Right, I, I think, I think we're looking pretty good. What about you? What do you think, Rosrus? Not that you care how we're looking, you pyromaniac gourmand. I mean, at least he's a good cook. I mean, that's part of the thing, right? Yeah, you get plus four. I mean, actually, plus four is not a lot. It might sound like a lot, but it's not a lot. Honestly, in the grand scheme of things. A war merchant from the Mitrobrin Alliance. Okay. Okay, this could be... This could be interesting. I don't know if it will be. I mean, I assume they're selling that cougar. I I'm assuming we don't want it. Or we don't need it, at least. I don't know what to assume. Get over here. There goes the refugee imperium. Nothing of value is lost. And when you're done meditating, go ahead and do a trade with Green, the war merchant. See what he wants. You meditate. Are you meditating? Meditating. Wow, I. Meditating. Okay, meditating. Are you Sylvia meditating in front of the stell or the tree? That's all I wanted to say. We could get a breeding pair of cougars. 
I'm not gonna pretend that's not tempting. Cause it's a little tempting. They are, you know, advanced. They could they could learn a lot of things. Problem is their diet. Because they don't eat veggies. Which is a little limiting. Oh, they have a warg too. I don't want a warg. Uh, you know, I'm gonna I might try to buy these. Let's see. Let's see what else we can do. You know, it depends on what we can trade overall. I don't want your silver ass knife. Um, we have some poor clothing. Yeah, that's that's easy sells. Especially when they're worth over a hundred bucks, despite being poor quality. Talk about a scam. Uh, oh well, crap. We ha we actually can afford it. Damn it. Look, I was I secretly didn't want to do this, but now I have to because I talked about it. Um, I don't really have to, but I'm gonna. I'm gonna, and you can't stop me. I'm not selling taffy. You can't make me do that. But you can, you know, buy some of my wool shirts. They're very comfy this day and age, you know? Give me, give me, give me some cash. Okay? And then train these cougars how to do everything. Uh, relationships, oh, they like that, yeah, yeah. Cougar, cougar. Here we go, cougars. Uh, I guess we can have as many. It's too bad you can't train them from here. Although I get it. It's fine. It's fine. I'm just gonna, we're just gonna do this. Yeah. yeah. We should probably have Taffy follow around at least during battle. Grizzly bear is a pretty tough cookie to have in a fight. You know. Anyway, how much longer? Five hours. Let's go. It's looking good. Okay, so we have two more. We have two cougars. Pretty great. Pretty, pretty tough animals. I mean, you know, they're big cats. Hard to complain. Especially if you can make them friendly and make them not attack us. Just remember to give them meat regularly. Make sure to give them their skin hardening cream. Cataphract armor. Don't mind if I do. You know, this would be some... This would be some heavy-ass armor to give somebody. Phoenix armor? Cataphract armor with a flame bolt launcher. I mean, that sounds pretty damn sexy. Volcanic frick. I mean, a volcanic winter is not the worst thing. Basically means your plants will grow slower for the year. Or it's seven years, however long they want it to be. Okay, Camaro is done. Your shield belt is normal, so you need... You know what? You're... You have, um... You have tenure, so you're getting the better shield belt first. Everybody's getting out! Everybody's getting out! And Pepsi's over here like, ugh, this crap. Get this out of here, it's gross! Uh, your melee's better- yeah, your melee's way better than your shooting. You really need to be a shooter. Okay, do that. Grab the shield belt. Live your best life. Um... Cool. But yeah, I could- I could throw down age reversals for everyone at this point. Squid, it's been a long time for you. You... You know, don't spend your time with the day lilies. Just... Pick a pod... And get yours as well. Okay? That'll be good. How do you do it on electricity? Uh, that's the one that's draining. Uh, 5,000... Yeah, we have enough to survive 12 hours. That's good. Ooh, the volcanic winter is also going to affect our solar generators, isn't it? It's not the worst thing in the world, even so. But, uh, it is something to keep in mind. So we're gonna give it a day or so, and then I think what we're gonna do, we're gonna do two things. One, we're gonna do a caravan first. We're gonna do a caravan to Delon. We're gonna try to get... There are two things I would really like to get. Actually, there are several things I'd like to get. But if I can get two Glitter World Medicine, I can cure most of what ails Dark Shadow, I believe. You know? It, it mean, yeah. I, I just need some Glitter World. So if I can, that's my number one thing I would like to get. Glitter World Medicine. Two of them. That's it. That's all I need. Um, Tech Prince, obviously, would be good. Okay, it is 5 a.m. I think that's early enough. Let's go ahead and start forming this caravan. Head over to Delon, see what they got. Uh, we're going to need to take a good trader. And honestly, Vasilla, you and Sir Hop are... Uh, two great options, so we're gonna take you two. Here, take some... Take the rat. <laughs> take the rat, take this gazelle, I don't even know why. Um... And that's it. 
I don't know. You, you gotta take some actual, like, hauling buffaloes, or at least one. Okay, and then we take crap. So as far as crap goes, uh, you know, take the clothing. Clothing doesn't have to be, like, stacked super high. That's why I want to take that, you know? It's easy. It's just, like, 12 things instead of 400 stacks of, like, silver. Much easier. Much easier. They're not, they're not going to want the tainted crap. Um, so we'll sell those. I know I could use the Resurrector Mech Serum, by the way, on... Uh, now take 100 Jade. Yeah, that'll, that'll also be a pretty chunk of pennies. Do it. I know I could take the Healer Mech Serum and give that to Dark Shadow, but it would only cure one thing at a time. So, you know, it doesn't take care of all of these. That's the problem. If it did, shooting frenzy for Camaro, great. Hallelujah. Basilla. You know what? Basilla, love what you're doing. Someone else can work on the sculptures while you're gone. Just saying. So yeah, the output's not not total over here in the solar generators generators words. We're missing about two to three hundred watts worth of power from each of them. But that's not the end of the world. You know? Does it suck? Yeah, it sucks. But we can live with it. We'll be fine. Look at it. Look how fast and Camaro's immediately like, quick, they're gone. Throw a party. Everybody's like, okay. Why are we throwing a party with them gone? I don't know, but just start partying, damn it. All right, fine. Uh, how long is it going to take for Squid's age reversal? 3.2 days? Yeah. We're just going to do the rest of them one at a time, I think. Unfortunately, you know, the downside is it doesn't give them, like, a long-term... That was a fast party, by the way. It doesn't give them a long-term mood boost, and I wish it did. We made it to Delon. All right, Delon. You don't like me, and I don't like you. You won't even buy my rats. In case you were wondering why I don't like you. 356, what a freaking scam, man. Do you have any... You do not have... You don't even have the... Glitter world medicine I want. Do you have anything I want? I'm selling the clothing. At least we could walk away with silver. You know? Ugh. You have a bionic arm. You don't have a lung, though. Circadian assistant. I mean, we can make stuff like that. They have an excellent Zeus hammer, which is neat. But I don't need it. I could always use advanced components, but I don't feel like buying it. Here, buy some chocolate for the road. You know, get, buy enough to give you, like, two days worth of food. There you go. Eight chocolates. It's fine. Okay, because we're going to have you go even farther. Uh, not to Corn Cobwood. <laughs> Sorry, that name. Um, frick, the only, uh, the only guys you can trade with are the butts. Nobody else... Well, I mean, I get technically they're neutral. But a lot of the others just hate us. Is there anyone else we could technically... Mitrobrans, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you know, where where the heck is their nearest? Up here? And they're not going to have Glitter World Medicine. We're going to get more cougars. That's good, I think. Yo, what does it take... Remind me, what does it take to build hospital beds? Five Componies and 120 Steel. Steel, not a big deal. But, I mean, we don't have a lot in the colony right now. That's because nobody's doing hauling. Like, literally nobody's hauling. I might need to up a haul order over here. Uh, Pepsi, why don't we put hauling at the same as cleaning? Ramos, you can clean over hauling. For now. Yeah, if we, as long as we have one person who hauls at a higher priority than cleaning... And at least one person who cleans at a higher priority than hauling, we should be fine. How long are these going to last? All right, we need to do something with these. These are just stuck in here. They've been stuck in here forever. Give me a dumping stockpile. Right here. Okay. Uh, no, Nothing fresh goes in here. It's rotten stuff. Okay, thank you. Means all the corpses should go in there, too. 
eventually, you know, once we decide hauling is a thing we're going to do. There, there you go. Sylvia has begun. And then she's like, nah, I got better things to do. Not, not, not really. I'm going to haul, haul this through. Prophetic building. Why does everybody just want us to build crap, dude? 42 relation with Butthom. Oh my god. And we only have to keep it from being destroyed for a month? That's really good. Ah, that's really... And we have 21 days to build it. This is really lenient for 42 relation. I feel like we should do this one. We don't... Ah, well... You know what? Metallic, Woody, or Stony, 540. So we really just need, like... 820 something or yeah, 826 stone which we don't have enough technically you know we have 3.5 days we'll, we'll think about it we'll think about it okay all right some people are getting hauling done that's important that's hugely important trading's about to get done that's also important huge big Xbox importance. You know? Hey. Right. Yeah, even with the slightly less solar, we're fine. It looks like. Got a lot of kibble over here, and I'm loving that. Got a lot of meat over here, and I'm loving that. Got a lot of meat in here. I got quite a bit of meat in here. Okay. Ariad, what do you got? Uh, advanced components, components, medicine. Ah, frick. A ram. Hmm, let's see. Claw, hand, ear. Man, I don't want to go uh, crawl into the freaking prestige cataphract armor in green, huh? I don't want to go to the freaking these guys. They don't even trade with most of us. What is this? Six huskies? For an artistic skill trainer? I don't want that. I don't see the point in checking out the Mitrobran Alliance. What about Camaraderie Meadow? How long does that take? 2.7 days. That's too long. What about over here with Uos? 2.1. That's still too long. Dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Hmm. Well, you know what? Actually, trade with these guys. Give me... There you go. Four days worth of food. We head over to Uos. It's 2.1 days. So to go from here to here and back to here is 4.7. That's a little too much. Just a little. 2.7. 4.7. Wait. It's the same? I'll head over here. At least... Stay on the road longer, I think. Actually, you can stay on the road the whole time if you go the other way. Maybe that's why it's just about the same. Yeah, I'd be on the road the whole time. Yeah. Yeah, go trade with Camaraderie Meadow. You can always find more food. Somewhere. I just need to know if someone has what we're looking for. I just need a crumb of Glitter World Medicine. Two of them, and Dark Shadow's good to go. Pr practically. I mean, obviously, if we could get a lung, that'd be good, too. If we could get one or the other, I'd probably go with the Glitter World Medicine. Because having the brain be at what percentage? Having, uh, having the brain be at 50% is not good. I don't know if you knew this. But uh, people are not designed to work at 50% of their brain capacity. They say you only use 20% of your brain. Well, first of all, what percentage percentage of your brain is the brain stem? Because that feels like it's a good 10 to 15% of your brain. And you're using that like 100% of the time without ever even thinking or feeling it being used. Because the brain stem handles all your autonomous functions. You know, you're breathing. Tells your heart to keep beating. You know, all that stuff. That's all regulated through the brainstem area. 
So that's already a huge chunk of your brain. So even if you didn't use any other part of your brain, you'd probably still be close to that 20%. Give me that jazz. All right. Squid, how we doing? 1.6 days. Has it really been that long already? Dude, time flies. Yeah, you'll be fine, though. You'll be fine. Silvermane, your mood's still pretty good. Consider oh, you got three lovins. That's why. Yeah, that'll do it. Horrific aging, but three lovins, so, you know. Kind of evens out. You get enough lovin', everything evens out. Dude is making us some advanced components right now. It's what makes the world go round. Someone working on that healing enhancer? Doll is working on that healing enhancer. I love it. Now, what I would really love... Okay, we're bringing in herbal medicine. Okay. Okay. That's that's not bad. Okay, so things are being hauled in right now. This is good. The problem is I feel like I'd have to spend the, the rest of 5506 just hauling stuff in. Sal 1 is pregnant. Or, Sal 1 has given birth. Sal 1 is pregnant. That was really fast. <laughs> that was really, really fast. Am I managing pigs at all? I'm not. Uh, I feel like we don't need to yet. Eh, maybe I do. Um, tell you what. No more than... No, 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 no. We can have infinity total. No more than, like, two adult males. I don't care about the... How many... Wait, we only have one female? Young? Do, if they're pregnant, do they not count as female? I'm very confused. Um... You know, it keeps, like, four or less... And then the little ones give them time to grow up. What is the age of the sow? The sow is 10 years old. So yeah, I guess it's kind of a weird way to count it. But so if they're pregnant, they're in their own column. Right? That's what it looks like. Because it says I have zero adult females. This female is 10 years old. That's a lamb. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. Anyway, how we doing? Failed training? I don't appreciate that. No, I want. I want to take a look at my animals here. Uh, one of the cougars knows how to guard, so they're learning. They're learning. They're getting there, man. Over time, they'll get there. Give me some. Uh, give me some animal meat. This thing's not full, and it could be, if we just put a little bit more effort into it. Alright, how are we doing over here? 1.5 days, 3.2 days worth of food. We're, we're gonna be fine, we're gonna be fine. Can they forage? 16.2 berries per day? Alright. That's good. Hot weather rots food faster. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Thankfully, the volcanic winter is keeping it plenty cool over here! Thankfully. How are we doing on animal beds? It looks like we have a piglet who's not in a bed, but that is... Piglet has a bed. Gazelle 1 has a bed. Where's Gazelle 1? I don't even see Gazelle. Oh wait, we're selling the Gazelle, duh. No we're not, because nobody will buy it. Ugh. I, mean, I guess we could slaughter it for food. Yeah, just go out there real quick, turn it into pemmican. I don't know, are either of you decent cooks? I don't think so. Two, that's not decent. Sir Hop? Uh, four, you're better. Not good, but better. You would probably still give you both food poisoning, so I'm probably gonna skip it. I saw a slaughter happening. Okay, 13 hours and squids out. I saw that slaughter happening. All right. Another failed attack training. Dang it. And we're trying. We're being persistent about it, which is good. Damn, that poor turkey didn't stand a chance, did it? Oh. Forgot about all this. I mean, I guess this stuff's not worth bringing in now. But, uh, we could always sell it to some poor saps. There's freaking 900 silver sitting over here. 
Look at, look, look at this. This is like a whole bunch of money just sitting over here in this area. It's not like the area is forbidden. It's not like we can't go down here. Is it too far away for you guys? Make you feel self-conscious? Alright. Yeah, just... Ugh. Ugh. I don't know, man. It's, they're just a burden at this point. They're not helpful. I guess worst case scenario, we bring them home and then eat them? Cataphract armor is buildable, baby. Alright, we still need a couple more tech prints for the other ones. But now some things should start getting done a little bit more quickly. You know? So we could already make grenadier armor, but now we could make phoenix armor. Which is cataphract armor with a built-in flame bolt launcher. Alright. It is especially flame resistant. I can't imagine why. Okay. They specialize in clearing out very confined spaces full of enemies. Very neat. However, slightly neater is the prestige, prestige, I can say words, cataphract armor. Six advanced components, 190 plasteel, 50 uranium, 18 gold. Yeesh. They are uh, not cheap. They help with psychic sensitivity, though. All right, squids out. Hey, there we go. Very cool, very cool. Let's see. Silver Mains treatment is overdue by quite a bit. I mean, we're going to want to use them for some stuff. Soon. Wait, we got some blocks? When did this happen? Hallelujah! <laughs> Guys, we got some blocks! <laughs> I can't believe it! In this day, in this age, I thought that was never going to happen. All right, well, you know, we're, we're past the 30 minute mark. I'm gonna set all the other constructions around here to be, did we get rid of the roof here? Yeah, you construct this. Give me some materials. That is gonna be it for this episode of that plays RimWorld Ideology. If you enjoyed it, be sure to let me know by giving a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more because it'll keep coming and it won't stop coming, not until it's over. We're gonna leave this one though. Thanks again for watching this episode of RimWorld Ideology. My name is Fett and I'll see you in the next video. Everybody-o.